God, that, that is awesome. Third thing, in Christ, we're filled. We're not just overcomers. We're not just acceptable. But in Jesus Christ, we are filled. We are satisfied. You could say it like that. And, and, and I don't know about you, but in fact, I do know about you. All of us are human. We're not satisfied in this world. The things of this life, they're not going to satisfy us. You're about to get some gifts for Christmas. Guess what? Eventually, you're not going to you're not going to be happy with that gift. Um, I'm I'm 42, so so you know I'm like a Nintendo dude. All right, back in the day, I was a Nintendo super champion. My wife thinks she was better than me, but she's not. She's oblivious. All right, I was I was the man, Super Mario Brothers champ. Anybody else play Super Mario Brothers? You all just admitted you're old. All right, anyway. <laughs> Uh, so, so you know, I, I remember how totally into that game I was. But before that game, there was something called Atari. Do y'all remember? How many of y'all remember Atari? Yeah. Now, Atari, you're really old, right? Yeah, you're really old. So Atari, right? Yeah. Atari was this joystick. Everybody's like, what's a joystick, man? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, joystick, you Pac-Man. The, the, this, this is so cool, but the Atari... The screen didn't move, right? Everything happened on the screen. It was simple. Pac-Man. Now, Pac-Man left the screen, but the screen stayed the same, right? Dig Dug. That is an awesome game, right? Anyway, all that stuff was Atari. Well, Atari got old. Before that, there was something called Pong. How many of y'all know Pong? Y'all are ancient, man. <laughs> ancient, if you know what Pong is. Pong was like this, this bar and a ball. That was it, man. It was like boom. And that it? That's the game. Anyway, so Pong, then Atari, then, then, uh, then uh, Mario Brothers or Super Nintendo, all that. Here's the deal. One thing led to another. It's obsolete. Today, it's like retro to have a Nintendo, right? I mean, I know there's, there's other kind of Nintendos now, but not the kind that was really awesome back then, you know? And now you got Xbox and you got PS4s. Which, I mean, obviously we're only created because PS3s were obsolete, which PS2s, I can remember PlayStation came out, right? And then it was just, anyway, why does all that happen? Because we get, we, we get where we're not satisfied. We're not satisfied. I mean, if you bought a new car in the last 10 years, it's because you weren't satisfied with the one you had. You buy new things because you're not satisfied with the thing. That is not bad about you. Listen what, what it is. it is. It is a reality about our human existence. This world will never satisfy us. It's not going to. It's not going to. It's a reality that the things of this world can't fill us. But Jesus can. Jesus can fill us. Why? He is the bread of life. Jesus is the bread of life. He's not just